You're listening to the Daily Sales Tips Podcast, and I'm your host, Scott Ingram. Today's tip comes from Fred Copestake. Over the last 22 years, Fred has traveled around the world 14 times, visited 36 countries, and worked with over 10,000 salespeople. He's taken the things that really make a difference in modern selling and put them in his book, Selling Through Partnering Skills. Here he is. This tip is be consistent. So being consistent comes from the sales challenge that I often see of having a muddled mindset. So a muddled mindset comes from when an organization isn't really sure exactly how they're supposed to be selling. They talk about being consultative, they talk about being solution-based, talk about being customer-centric, but when push comes to shove, at the end of the month, what we find is that the, the guidance becomes very, very transactional. We're trying to sell as much stuff as we possibly can to hit a target. So this makes it difficult for the salesperson to decide what to do. And it makes it difficult for managers to support the salesperson in doing the right thing. They don't know if they should be doing one thing or the other. So it becomes quite confusing. So the best way to overcome this is to make sure we have alignment. And it really does start at the top. Management should be clear on what we're trying to achieve, how we're going to achieve that, which is passed to managers so that they can enforce that or reinforce that. So they can become far better in the way that they coach. And then what the individual can do is that they can go about their work clear and confirmed in the way that they know is how they should be operating. Works for the customer, works for them, works for the organization. Clarity, coaching, confirmation. That's how we can make sure that we're not being inconsistent and develop a far more effective approach to selling. For a link to Fred's LinkedIn profile and to take his free 60-second modern selling assessment, just click over to dailysales.tips forward slash 989. Once you've done that, be sure to come back tomorrow for another great sales tip. Thanks for listening. 